Hello Pisces, Rad here from Radko Tarot and this is going to be your weekly tarot reading May 14th to May 20th 2018. So uh, four cards spread, the first one that shows up the topic of your week, this is going to be the temperance card, then we do have the core of the situation that is going to be the death. Then is the challenge that you need to overcome. This is going to be the, the Knight of Cups. And the last one, it is uh, the Guidance from Tarot for you. That will be the Seven of Pentacles. Wow, alright. So, uh, this uh, week will be all about making your stand. Because... Um, and making your stand in a sense that something is going to divide you with a, a person here. And divide you in a sense of uh, agenda goals, etc, etc. Um, uh, what I'm trying to say, let me give you an example for explaining what I'm trying to say. Uh, in case you're in a relationship, alright. This could play out very well, that's a, a very good opportunity for you to come for a job, but in a different state, let's say. And this is where the issue comes, you know, because probably your boyfriend or your girlfriend will not be very amused by finding out that you want to go and work at that state. So this is what we, uh, what you, Pisces, may experience during that particular week. And that kind of a separation is what I'm talking about. Here we are not talking about an ending of relationships or jobs. It is just we are talking about that uh, a um, specific beneficial goal will appear for you that will not be very liked from a peep for a person there to your heart and uh, just so you and uh, you to capitalize on that particular um, proposition offer you know or an opportunity um, you have to do things or rather like you need to act against what they really want to see you acting upon all right so what happens here is that if not utilized correctly, you may leave uh, that kind of a situation not in a very good terms with this person. But because we do have the temperance, it does shows that the uh, <clears throat> that the possibility you can uh, you can keep the uh, the task at hand, which is uh, something you have waited for a quite a long time, by the way, because we do have the death card here. Uh, uh, and as well the person that it is there to your heart it is very passable you do have the means necessary to find the middle way you know the way uh, uh, that goes no, uh, in neither of the sides in other words you uh, don't go to the extreme either being dived into one relationship and missing that opportunity or going for the opportunity um, and missing the relationship in the same way. So how this could happen is by you uh, explaining yourself. So the temperance, it is all about showing that it is all about showing that your opinion, your life, uh, it is equal, it has an equal value with the life of others, you know, and at the end of the day, um, people need um, more and people need, uh, you know, to feel productive and etc, etc. And when you show that you are going to feel happier when you go for that task, your beloved, either a male or a female, will totally understand that they will show compassion and there is a, a huge chance a, a, an inevitable chance that a, a compromise will be made. <clears throat> now, however, we do have the Seven of Pentacles as a, um, a guidance card. And Seven of Pentacles, it is all about holding yourself down for a moment and wait. Alright? So, uh, this specific uh, reading here says that you should not make up your decision straight away, or at least not this week, but you need to leave your that, your couple options available, you know, and open for the weeks that are yet to come. Why? Because as a guidance, this card says that there is something yet to happen, all right, which is going to give you the right, um, or is going to make the correct choice obvious for you and thus you will not going to make any wrong decisions whatsoever as well the seven of pentacles points that you very carefully need to scale the efforts you are placing or you will continue on placing either into your relationship or either into your career so you find the middle way here 
uh, to uh, juggling between boats. All right. So this is all for you, Pisces. It is all about mitigating in between career and relationships, so you can give them necessary means to both of them. All right, <clears throat> and not uh, and not leave on the back seat neither of them. So uh, it will be uh, somewhat a tough week. Because uh, every time when one needs to reach a state of compromise, it is a tough thing to do. But at the same time, uh, this reading says that you will reach a, a healing and a recuperation in the both fields, career and relationship. It is because what I said here is that the circumstances long time waited for either advancing into your career or into your relationship finally will come here with an unexpected change the core of the situation all right <clears throat> that will allow you to advance forward with both of them but again i want to stress this one out what is important here is to don't scratch out neither of those but to seek the compromise uh, the compromise in the actions here and the compromise in the decision you're about to make so you can keep the both benefits from the both opportunities because this is very very um possible to be achieved so um this was your tarot reading Pisces for the upcoming week. I hope you guys enjoyed it and you liked it. And in case you're interested in a private reading with me, everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rod signing out now. See you next time. Bye.